Hello guys, this is Ratu498 and this is a 1v1 commentary battle on Shogun 2 Total War. Uh, this is a classic battle I believe, and this is Yellow from the Virus Clan who is playing as Shimazu. And this is uh, Gerudo Angel of War I believe his name is, and he's playing as Takeda. Okay, so, um, anyone that's unaware of the situation, these guys are in some kind of clan war at the moment. Uh, Virus and Gerudo. Uh, there'll be a link to the um, forum page where they're uh, discussing it. Um, it's a really good read, so everyone should go along and have a quick look. Well, I'll just quickly run through their choice of builds. We've got a couple of Yari Ashigaru, a couple of Bow Samurai, uh, a couple of Bow Warrior Monks, uh, some Katana Sams. He's got a General. And we've got a Great Guard, a Great Guard, and two Yari Cav. And over here, a uh, Najinata Warrior Monk. And the same on the opposite flank, so that's his build. Uh, this build, Katana, 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 Katana Cav. A Fire Cav. Uh, some Warrior Monks, Nodachi. Matchlock Samurai. More Warrior Monks. Uh, some more S Katana Sam. Some Barash Go. Some more Matchlock Samurai. Uh, Najinata Warrior Monks, Nodachi. And uh, one more Barash Go. Uh, General and Katana Sam. So that's their builds. Now this is the first time watching these re this replay. Um, Yellow's watched it before he sent it to me so this shouldn't be bugged so it shouldn't be a problem. Right, so as we see we've got the Yari Ashigaru in front for uh, Yellow so he's going to form some kind of spear wall probably and he's going to use his bow advantage to force his opponent to attack. Uh, lots of Takeda Cav, I believe the uh, Takeda Cav are um, better in the classic battles than normal cav, I believe that's like their clan speciality. So lots of katana cav for them. So we've got some great guards going in and some yari cav and they've gone in with some national warrior monks and they're going to do quite a lot of damage, they've got fire cav there but they're going to do quite a lot of damage to these cav units especially as yari down here with these uh, katanas. The yari are much better fighting cav than the katanas. Oh so we've got uh, spear walls uh, we've got uh, Yari Ashigaru advancing into these matchlocks to try and get rid of them. All the bows are firing off. Down on this flank we've got two no uh, one Nodachi, one uh, Nashinata Warrior Monk and with another uh, Nashinata Warrior Monk and a Katana Samurai there from Yellow. Uh, Yellow managed to route away one of the um, matchlock units. One of the Yari Ashigaru units is routed, the other one's routing away now. The bows are managing to fire in, although some of the Katana Cav, which were engaging earlier with the Yari, have managed to come around and they're getting into the bows, which is going to stop them from firing at least. Even if he doesn't manage to kill them all off, it will give them a little bit of a... Uh, a respite from being shot. As you can see, Angel of War has managed to move most of his units around to the uh, left-hand side of his lines. So he's going to try and attack down through this space here. Over on this flank, the Nashinata Warrior Monks. The Cav is still engaged here. He probably should have pulled these, this uh, Fire Cav out, as the uh, Warrior Monks are going to do a decent job on them. Uh, Katana Cav are out in the way there. Yari Cav are engaged with them. In the centre, we have got another Katana Cav. They're in with two great guards, but he's got some spears in there as well, some Nazanata Warrior Monks, and no Dachis are routing away. Uh, he's also got some Katana Cav, which are engaged with Yellow's Katana Samurai. Some more Nazanata Warrior Monks coming in. And down here on this flank, we've got more Katana Sam, and some Nazanata Warrior Monks, which are engaged with more Nazanata Warrior Monks and no Dachis. And the Barashigaru as well seem to have gone in from Malay there, I'm not sure whether that was intended or not. Over on this flank as you can see the um, Cavs have all been right away now, so these units are free to come around and flank. Uh, over here it looks like Yellow's going to win this, uh, this little engagement down here as well to be honest, with the units that he's got. The bows are firing in, but there's all no unit right away there. Yellow's got his general in stand and fight. His bows, uh, they're just starting to fire off again now. Uh, that bow samurai unit's been destroyed by the Katana Sams. More Katana Sams in here, which are doing a pretty decent job, even though they say they're losing, they managed to route units away, so that's not so bad over there. Warcry's been hit over here on these uh, Katana Samurai from the Yellows, who is obviously green. The National Warrior Monks now routing away, along with one of the Katana Samurai. We've got some more National Warrior Monks in there. And up here now, these Katana Samurai have now engaged into this Barash Shigaru unit, and uh, he's Yellow's also got some Great Guard engaged with the Barash Shigaru up there. There's some Katana Sams down here that are engaged with two Bow Warrior Monks. The Bow Warrior Monks aren't that actu actually that bad in melee. They'll probably hold out for just a little while in there. 
There's quite a few men lost to that general there, but I don't think there's going to be too much of a problem. The Katana Samurai fighting the Nationality Warrior Monks. Uh, it's looking pretty close at the moment, in all fairness. It's in a way it's going. I believe Yellow wins this, so we'll see how it ends out. Uh, Small National Warrior Monks there, gone in with the uh, to attack the General. So now his General's been destroyed, uh, these units might rat away really, really quickly. So, 41 men left in that Katana Samurai unit. He's not enough to worry amongst 36, 35 left. Engaged in a 70 strong Katana unit. These units ran away, ran away. Casualties sustained, casualties sustained. So these Nudge Nudge Warrior Monks are doing a great job here at holding these guys up, and that's, yeah, that's pretty much the end of the battle now. So that was a good game to both these guys. Uh, that's the first game. I'm going to show you another one as well, uh, between Yellow and a member of the Gerudo clan. But that is the first game. So that was a good game to both the players. And that's the end. Uh, so we're going to start the next one off uh, just about now. Okay, guys, this is the second battle, and this is a game between Novum Invictus, I believe we'll call him. And this is, I believe it is, an avatar battle. So this is not a classic battle, this is an avatar battle. Uh, so we've got one great guard, Katana Cav, Katana Cav. On that flank, over on this flank, we've got a Fire Cav and another Katana. In the centre, we have got Nationata Warrior Monk, Nationata Warrior Monk, uh, Nodachi, Nodachi, and Nodachi. And we've got some uh, Bow Warrior Monks in the centre. So, not really a very big spear force, so I think he's hoping to um, win the calf battle. So let's we'll see what his opponent's got. And we have some Nashinata Samurai, uh, more Nashinata Samurai. Attendants, uh, some Nashinata uh, Warrior Monks, uh, more Nashinata Warrior Monks. Going right away through the line there. Uh, Nashinata Attendants through the front, and some Yari go in the very front. The calf force is... Uh, Nationata Warrior Monk Cav, Katana Cav, uh, Nationata Warrior Monk, uh, so it's three Nationata Warrior Monk and two Katana Cav. So that is their build. So looking at their build ratings, I would have probably said that um, Gwyndain from Gerudo probably had the better build in this, build, in this battle. But there's no missile units for um, Gwyndain. Gwyndane, not called him Gwyndane, I think that's probably right. So there's no missile units, so um, in Nova Invictus is going to be able to lure him forward into a hammer to attack, otherwise you're just going to sit there all day and shoot him. Looks like he's going to attack anyway. Right, just moving himself forward. So we've got Cav battles going on this side, we've got um, National Arts Warrior Monk Cav with out the bonus versus cav experiences on so they're not going to do very well against these great guard um, these katana cav they're going to do a little bit better but they're not going to do very well against a great guard at all but he's got some spears following up uh, the general's coming across there Nova Invictus managed to get his cav around the rear as well now so there's two katana cav come back down there and there's uh, katana cav and a fire cav here so if uh, if he charges those fire cav in then they'd basically destroy those katana caps really really quickly. The bows are still firing off, he's managed to rout away that Yari Ashigaru unit. Over on this flank, uh, the Nashinata Warrior Monk have managed to rout away one of the katana cav. And the Great Guard, oh he's managed to get his general. So if he manages to rout away that general it's going to make things very difficult for Gwyndain here to actually um, go on and win this battle. So the katana cav are pulling out. So, um, personally I'd have said Gwyndain, as soon as he saw that uh, his opponent had bows and he had none, he should have pretty much just rushed him instantly uh, to try and save the losses and just basically get on with it, my personal opinion. The one thing you don't want to do is get into a situation where you're just going to keep getting shot at, because you can see there's a couple of units already routed away, and that's, that's all just three units, basically, that you're losing. So, we've got um, National Artillery and Monks coming in, and they're all just going to go into engage each other here. Right the way up the line, as you can see. Pretty even, just unit for unit. So we've got Cav coming around the back. 
great cards. Uh, the two Katana Cav, uh, one Katana Cav and Fire Cav pulled right away. But as you can see here, there's no general, so it's going to make it really, really hard for Gwyndane's units to hold on, especially with this Cav unit coming around the back. Anywhere it hits, it's just going to see right away that unit. Um, he's hit Warcry. Novum Invictus has hit Warcry, so he's going to be able to destroy those units really, really quickly. As you can see there, if you don't have a general in this and you lose your general really early, literally the battle's over before it even begins. The most important thing in this game is keeping your general safe until, well, literally the last man. So, a great guard unit against Katana Cav. At the moment, I think it's just a case of it doesn't really matter. So, but this is all over already. So, it was a good game to both these guys. Um, hopefully, Gerudo are going to send me some replays uh, that they've got of them beating Virus. So, I'll be able to post them as well. And as I say, the link uh, to the forum thread will be in the description to this video. And everyone has to go check that out. It's really good. Really good read. Okay, guys, that was a good game to everyone. Uh, thank you very much, everybody. Uh, please rate, comment, subscribe, and uh, I'll see you later on.